In today's tech tip, I'll be showing you how to use WhatsApp on your iPad and I'll be showing you how to do everything correctly so you can actually use WhatsApp comfortably and conveniently on your iPad. Now before you get started, I just want to say something that the App Store does not have the official WhatsApp application. So if you go to the Apple App Store and try to find WhatsApp, you won't find it. You'll only see all these third party applications but you won't find the WhatsApp application. In fact, you can find it, but you cannot install it. So here it is, WhatsApp, and as you can see, it says not compatible with this device. So WhatsApp, or rather Meta, has not created an official app for the iPad. But I'm gonna show you the best workaround. Now, this is going to involve linking your WhatsApp account from your phone to the iPad. And so to do that, just go to your Safari browser and then go to web.whatsapp.com and go to that URL. Now this is going to open WhatsApp web on your iPad and allow you to link your device. So you can pick up your device, whether it's Android or iPhone and link your WhatsApp account to the iPad. So for this one, I'm just gonna go and tap on the three dots in the top right corner, select link a device, tap on link device. Of course, I have to authenticate myself and then scan that QR code. And now I should have my WhatsApp account right here. So here we are, we are already inside WhatsApp and we are good to go. So now I can use WhatsApp, I can chat but WhatsApp is linked to my main WhatsApp account on my iPhone or on my Android phone. But as you can see, I have WhatsApp ready to go, okay? Now, to make this convenient, you need to have WhatsApp on your app screen, okay? So if you tap on the share icon in the top right corner, from the menu, scroll and find add to home screen. So tap on that, and then you can see it's gonna be called WhatsApp web just gonna go ahead and delete that web and leave it as WhatsApp with the WhatsApp logo and then tap on add. And now, as you can see, we have WhatsApp on the iPad. And every time I tap on this link, it's gonna take me to WhatsApp. Now, for some reason, you have to set it up a second time. I'm not even sure why it does that, but let's go ahead and do that. And from now on, I should be able to simply launch WhatsApp by using that particular shortcut, okay? So now, just like any other app on my iPad, I can just open that and it goes to WhatsApp. Now, you can also go ahead and turn on notifications. So if you tap on that and then allow notifications, it means you're gonna be getting notification badges on this icon when you get WhatsApp messages. So you can actually use this full time and you can enable notifications like that and just use this to chat on WhatsApp. So I can go to any contact, say hi, just chat as usual using WhatsApp on your iPad. Of course, we're using WhatsApp web here. And that is basically how to get and use WhatsApp on your iPad. Thanks for watching comments and questions down below and good luck.